Matthew Ladd here. This week on Group Carols Montreal TNT Trucks and Tips, I want to talk about the heating and the AC controls on your Kenworth 2.1 meter cap. Whether it be a Kenworth medium duty, T180, T280, 380, 480, or 480V, or a Kenworth T680, T880, or W990, you're going to have the same setup to these controls. So let's go take a look how they work. So right now we're currently in manual mode. You can see that the auto light is not lit up and I have a blue light here, a blue light here, and a blue light here. Now if I click on automatic mode, there's multiple temp sensors in the truck and you'll see I'm at 72 degrees right now. That is lit up blue. Now if I just want it to be in automatic mode but I only want the air to hit my feet, it's really simple. Just touch this here and you'll see that will light up blue. I'm in 72, but my fan is still on automatic mode. The second you touch the fan, well now I'm automatically out of automatic temperature control mode. There's also a great button here for max defrost. So that if your window does start to get foggy, instead of turning this, this, and this, which is three buttons that you're not focused on the road and you're reaching over the side, you simply, I'll put it back to where it was, you simply click here and it does the equivalent of those three turns. All at once, once your windshield is defrosted, you click auto here and you return back to your normal mode. Another great button on these trucks is right here, people often overlook, the fan with the man sleeping. If you click on this, you can hear it over my shoulder. Now the air conditioning or the heating is split between the front and the back of the cab, which can allow you to preheat or pre-cool your sleeper compartment before you stop for the end of the day. And that's a quick look at the heating and air conditioning controls on your Kenworth 2.1 meter cab. That's Group Kenworth Montreal TNT, Trucks and Tips, and I'm Matthew Ladd. Stay tuned for more tips in the future. Thank you.